Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to the channel. Robin here with Aries Fire Tarot. Welcome. I think I said that already, but anyway, we're doing a daily tarot card reading for Wednesday, May 27th, and I'm using the Tattoo Tarot Ink and Intuition. And this is just going to be a tiny little reading to help you guys tune into the energy available to you today. And I hope you enjoy. So I do, this is a three card reading. Um, I'm gonna look at a card to describe the day and a couple more cards after that. So like I said before, I hope you enjoy and I hope it resonates and thanks again for being here guys. So I'm going to basically shut it and just move along. So let's pull you a card that is going to describe the day for you. And I feel like I just need to shuffle one more time. I do try to keep the intro short, especially on these short readings. I'm being guided to just show you guys the bottom of the deck, which very rarely happens. I have not seen the card yet. Oh man, again. So, I don't do reversals. The cards, I literally get a ticker tape of words in my head and that's how I read the cards. Sometimes that's why I gaze off into the distance so I can see it a little bit better or close my eyes. So, card to describe the day, and here she is again. And we've seen the shadow self, we've seen the devil come through in multiple daily tarot readings in the past few weeks. So, um, you know, sometimes it just feels like you're chained to something in life and you can't get away from it. And it's like, things do keep coming around you guys to test you in a different way. But the thing about you is, like, you're probably getting stronger every day. And maybe something is going to be a little bit easier to overcome, right? So really keep this in mind, you guys. If you're being leaded into leaded into temptation, I don't know if I got that right. Um, lead me not into temptation. Um, you know, sometimes it takes a great strength of will, and sometimes it takes other people to help support you especially if it's a particularly devastating and I'm getting like you just always are in a battle when you see the the devil the shadow self and the, the battle is with yourself right um and this is very uncomfortable situation that people often don't like to talk about and why you might want to deal with strangers instead of people closer to you if you're having a tough tough day you know if you do have a vice it's probably gonna look extremely appetizing today, so be very careful. So on that note, I'm going to pull something important to be mindful of. You can change the energy here, you guys. We've got the chariot card, and this looks like a very hectic chariot card, but he's actually completely in control, and the horses are very much in sync. So this is important. Even then, when things feel like they're out of control, they're absolutely as they need to be. So you gotta watch that slippery slope. And for some people it's gonna mean, you know, having a donut or having a cigarette or I don't know. I could, like the list goes on and on. If you have a particular vice, you already know what it is. You don't need me sitting here and guessing them like it's Jeopardy. So be very, very cognizant of the fact that you are always in charge of your energy. You don't need to rely on something else to turn it around. Um, deep breathing really helps. This is why people meditate. What to embrace to have the best day possible. Aw, guys, this is so important. We've got the Hierophant here. So I really love this card because I think a lot of people have been struggling as of late and it's been a very, very difficult and challenging time on a global basis, right? So you got to remember your faith, you guys. Um, really remember that your team of spirit guides, your angels, you know, your God, everything is here to support you, everything and every energy. And if you don't believe in God, you know... You know, you can count on other people. I do get comments sometimes from people asking for support and I'm, I'm glad to give it as much as I possibly can, you guys. I also have a Facebook page and I do get um, direct messages there too. So if I can help you in any way, shape or form because, you know, I've been through my own uh, period of addiction and it was not pretty. 
And like, honestly, the thing that really bothers me now is that nobody ever tried to help me. They just let me sort of slip away. And I had to fight a great big battle to come back. And like, I'm kind of in control of that energy, you know, but I mean, I, I still get tempted, you guys. I totally get it. So if you're having this kind of period where wow okay yeah that doesn't that doesn't feel so good or i really am tempted to do like an online shopping spree that i can't afford that's gonna break the bank you know get together with your community that helped you in the first place or you know shout out in the comments down below and i'm here to support you guys on your journey no matter how glamorous or dark it gets because it's gonna happen to all of us at some period of time so anyway, guys, interesting card for you, um, zzz, cards for you. I just want to send you love and light and many blessings and from my heart to yours, okay? So take care.